Hi there. So are you using the older Flex Aerobase licensing service for virtual GPU? If so, there are some important considerations that you need to think about in the next year or so. In order for NVIDIA to fully own the development and life cycle of our licensing service, we've moved to an in-house developed solution from the previous Flex Aerobase solution that we've been using for virtual GPU for some years. So firstly, how do you know if you're using the old legacy base license server? Well, this is what the configuration screen looks like. The new licensing service is also virtual appliance base. So if you've installed the license server on a Windows or a Linux VM, then that's a good telltale sign that you're using the previous legacy license server still. So when do you need to do the migration to the new NLS by? So we'll be supporting the Flexera or legacy license server until 31st of July, 2023. At this date, the licensing service won't switch off, but we won't be releasing any new patches or fixes for it. This date coordinates with the end of life date for the last version of virtual GPU that only supports the Flexera license server, which is virtual GPU version 11. Also note that we've deprecated the use of Flexera within virtual GPU 14, so future releases of virtual GPU won't be supporting the Flexera license server. Another good reason for you to do this migration sooner rather than later. One other thing to consider is in order to use the NVIDIA licensing service, you'll need to be on virtual GPU version 13 or above or using NVIDIA AI Enterprise. If you're not, you'll just need to plan an upgrade of your virtual GPU manager on your hypervisor and the virtual machine drivers within your VMs before you migrate to NLS. So what's the process for migration? Well, the first thing to point out is that this migration is an out of band process. So nothing you do within the licensing portal online is going to affect the day-to-day -day operation of your existing Flexera license server. That'll run just fine in the background while you're migrating across. So the first thing you'll need to do is return your entitlement from your existing license server back into the licensing portal. After releasing these entitlements, what you can then do is use the video that I've linked at the end of this video to reallocate this entitlement to either the cloud-based license service or the new delegated licensing service so that you can service upgraded clients. What we can now do is change the hypervisor driver on our hypervisors and gradually move our clients across to the new DLS or CLS while maintaining the existing Flexera license server infrastructure for non-upgraded clients. Once this part of the process is over, we can then decommission the Flexera licensing server and we're now in the wonderful new world of NLS. Okay, so that's a quick overview of the process to move from the Flexera based license server or legacy license server through to the new NVIDIA licensing service. If you want to find out the whole process for installing either the CLS or the DLS version of the NVIDIA licensing service, then check out the link in the corner of this video now. Thank you.